A friend of Steve's introduced him to Robbie, a kid suffering from cerebral palsy, riding around in a beat-up wheelchair. Steve hopes he can help him out. How's it going, Robbie? All right. Good to see you. Doing all right? Yeah. Yeah? Just tell me about what you're into. I dig movies. What movie? Fair, fair, Fasters and the Furious. Oh, yeah, Fast and Furious. Yeah. Really? Yep. He loves the movie Fast and the Furious. His eyes lit up as he described the cars, the paints. We're going to do something really special for Robbie. We're going to do you a nice chair. This chair? This one's old. Yeah, hey, we're going to get rid of this one. Finally, thank you. <laughs> no problem. We'll get you a really good one, brand new. OK. Steve wants to get Robbie a new chair, even if he has to buy it himself. Kristen, got something for you. I met a kid who's got cerebral palsy, and he's in a wheelchair. His chair looks horrible. What we're going to come up with is tricking out his chair, making it look all cool. And I need to get you to get online, try to find a wheelchair manufacturer, maybe, that wants to donate a chair for us doing it. Oh, that's really sweet. It's good to do charity, because I wouldn't really do it on my own. So it's nice when someone kind of puts you in that position where they're like, hey, do something nice. And then you kind of realize how good it feels. A free, a free chair? Well, you'll probably find a company willing to donate a chair when you tell them we're going to redo the whole thing, make it all kind of cool colors, and present it to the kid. He's about to graduate, so we're going to try to make it coincide. OK, I can do that. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Yeah. We know Robbie's graduating soon. I had Kristen get a hold of him and find out the details. Robbie is graduating from high school soon and Steve really wants the chair to be ready for him by then. What about the discs? Aluma luster. Probably gonna leave the front wheels alone since they get a, a lot of action. Let's pull it out and uh, get it powder coated black. It'll be able to take a beat and be with him for a while. Let's get it apart then. I'm sure we'll think of some more stuff as soon as we uh, dig in and do it. Doing the chair pieces is gonna be interesting. We're gonna do Aluma luster on the clear plastic parts. Uh, they they kind of make it gonna look like a racing hubcap. On the fenders themselves, we're going to use the Imperial Chrome, which is a full-on 100% chrome finish. And it's done by using a series of chemicals in water. And by applying an activator and a rinse, and along with the chrome itself, we get a 100% mirror finish in a matter of seconds. Time. What do you say, Robbie? What do you think? You like it? Got a little of everything on here. Check it out. Okay. I even put a cop light on the front. Check it out. See that? Look, wow. Woo. Just grab it right in the middle. Thank you. Oh, when I heard Steve was going to do this for him, it was such a blessing to us. He really needed a new chair, and it'll be great for him to um, have this fancy new chair for his graduation. I love the fact that as soon as he was in the new chair, he looked over at the old one and said, take that thing out of here. He was the center of attention. People were taking pictures and everybody lining up and just wanted to be around him in the chair. And I thought that was great. 